in this video we are going to find out the smallest and largest among three numbers and terms. So here first of all we have defined a class small large. We have taken three variables. One variable we have taken as a small, another variable we have taken as large. And here initially I have entered only two numbers. So first of all I would like to find out the larger and smaller between these two. So let us do that. So if a is more than b then small is small is b and large is a uh, and else else small is a and large is b so i hope everybody has understood this now here uh, smaller is a and then larger is larger is b so here we have printed the larger one also so let us see that suppose the first number is 12 and second number is five, 4 now you can see that the smaller is 12 so why if a is more than b so if a is more than b small is a Oh, oh sorry children here we need to print small and here we have to print large okay now it's fine and it is 12 and 4 so smaller is 4 and larger is larger is which is 12 okay now in order to find out the in order to find out the smallest and largest among three we must include the third number here so if if a small is more than c this c is going to replace this small and if large is less than c then this c is going to replace this large and now just change this message smallest and here largest so this is what now here it is 12 and 4, 3 and uh, okay the third number I have not entered. So children here just include the third number. So enter third number. So that is C is SS dot next and T. So here first number is 12, second number is 3, fourth, third number is 67. Now you see that. The smallest is 3 and the largest is 67. 12, 3 and 67. Now here, suppose 3 numbers I have entered 12, 3 and 67. So this is A, this is B and this is C. So first of all compare these two. So here it is 12 and here it is 3. 12 is more than 3 so this small will become 3 and this 12 uh, this will become 12 okay so now so till now we managed to get the larger and the smaller between these two now just include the third one so here small is this small is small is 3 and this large is 12 so what to do here it is 3 it is 67 c is 67 and this 3 is not more than 67 so a small will remain 3 and here it is 67 the c is 67 and this large is 12 and the 67 is more than 12 so 67 will replace large so this is how we Manage to find out the smallest and largest among three numbers entered. Okay, now see the next example. Another one example here it is suppose 10, here it is suppose 5, and here it is uh, suppose here it is 55, and here it is 6. What is happen? What will happen? See, it is A, it is B, it is C. A is not more than B so else part will execute so this is small will become 10 
and this large will become it will become 55 now what will happen this is small is 10 this large is 55 this 10 is more than 6 so what will happen this is small will become 6 and this c which is 6 and it is not more than 55 so nothing will happen so smallest is 6 and largest is 55 so i hope you have understood this concept and i hope you have enjoyed this video thanks for watching